hey guys um we just trying to make some videos on the buffering systems of the body and um, hemoglobin has to be one type of the buffering system of the body all right so we're making a video on the hemoglobin buffering system so basically we are discussing the mechanism of action of the hemoglobin buffering system and um, this is your hemoglobin all right having two alpha and two beta chain okay so this hemoglobin buffering system of the body transports oxygen from lungs to peripheral tissues. It transports carbon dioxide from the peripheral tissues to lungs, okay, so that it could breathe out to exhale, okay. So now hemoglobin is a buffer for both carbon dioxide and hydrogen. So now um, carbon dioxide diffuses across your red blood cell membrane. Now, um, the carbon dioxide can bind directly with hemoglobin and be released in the lungs, okay? Carbon dioxide can bind with hemoglobin directly and be released in the lungs. So now, um, the, the carbon dioxide that reacts with water forms what carbonic acid. We have already spoken about this reaction on our video on the carbonic acid bicarbonate ion buffering system, okay? Now it can um, carbon dioxide can react with water to form carbonic acid. Okay. Now this carbonic acid will dissociate into bicarbonate and hydrogen. Okay, in the red blood cell. So now um, bicarbonate bicarbonate ions diffuses into plasma in exchange for chloride ion. Okay. So now um, hydrogen binds to hemoglobin. And can be released in red blood cells in the lungs to combine with bicarbonate and reform um, carbon dioxide for exhalation. Okay, hydrogen binds with hemoglobin and can be released in red blood cells in the lungs to combine with bicarbonate. Okay, so that's like H H for hydrogen plus HCO3 two. Okay, so it will form what? Um, HCO3, all right, it will form a water molecule and it will release what CO2 for exhalation, right? That's it. That's it. CO2 binding with water to give you what carbonic acid, carbonic, carbonic acid dissociating into H plus and um, HCO3. Now, imagine and um, this H plus and HCO3 are to combine, all right, when they combine two hydrogen, all right, that's H2. All right, H2, okay, sorry, H2, all right, then you carry one oxygen here, put it here, okay, H2O, that's what I produce, then it's remaining what, one carbon and two oxygen, okay, that's CO2, all right, produce like that, okay, so that's it, mechanism of action of hemoglobin buffering system. Bye for now, guys.